What's all this talk about Tavistock, the developer who built out Lake Nona's next project, Sunbridge? Well, today we're gonna check it out and I'm gonna tell you all about it. Let's dive right in. Sunbridge is designed as this kind of like naturehood where basically the, the community is centered around the idea that nature should be an integral part of daily life. It offers new homes, workplace, eateries, parks, pools, shops, and schools. So they're building a school, a K through eight in the community and right down the street, less than like five minutes away, they're gonna build the Publix right there on Narcusi and in the street that turns into Sunbridge and then they're gonna have this marina that they're building out. So the marina, it's gonna have 48 acres. And right now, what they're doing at base camp, which is a little spot when you drive in, there's a base camp there. Basically, they have food truck Fridays and they have yoga on Saturdays as well. So it's gonna be this massive community with all sorts of activities. And they're already starting, you know, to get together with the food truck Fridays and the yoga Saturdays. All right, first one we're gonna check out is the trainer model, Ashton Woods. Let's take a look inside. Walk in, you have a half bath right there. When you first walk in, and you have a storage closet right here. Then you got dining, we got a kitchen. Look at this floor plan. It's amazing. Look at this massive island. Okay, okay. We have a nice size walk-in pantry. You know me, I'm all about the snacks. Nice backsplash there. Then you got the living room right here. And you got like custom cabinets right here closet there let's take a look upstairs Laundry, primary, we got the primary, nice, got like nice little patio between the home and the garage what's also pretty interesting is not a lot of people are talking about this but a miami-based developer is planning a new 47 acre private sports complex near sunbridge as well so the complex is actually going to focus on soccer racket sports with facilities including a fitness center, event hall, cafe, pro shop, locker rooms, and accommodations for 60 athletes. The architectural plan includes standard and clay tennis courts, paddle courts, pickleball courts, stadium courts suitable for all training and tournaments. And the complex is also gonna feature a full, a five full-size soccer fields and three kid-size soccer fields as well. So there's a sports complex coming near 
Sunbridge, which is gonna be awesome for all you sports people out there. This one is the Seacrest by Craft Homes. Very nice elevation. Loving the red doors and the curb appeal with the stone. And you got the brick. This is sick. All right, Sunbridge. Whoa. I've seen a lot of floor plans, but not a lot of them take my breath away like this one. So we have dining. We got a little bathroom right there, guest bath. Then you have the kitchen tucked away over here with the subway tile backsplash. You got the gourmet oven over here. I'm not feeling the green, but whatever. Pantry, nice size for all the snacks. Okay, they kind of got like a green theme going on. I see the green drapes. Oh, this is sick. All right, so now we have Kind of like a mud room. Mud room, I guess you want to call it right here. You can hang the keys up there. Leads you to your two car garage. Kind of like a bungalow style home. With the garage in the back. I think they call it front loading or rear loading. Storage here or your little therapy closet with a couch already in there. Okay, okay. We kind of got like a, not really a loft, but like a small space right there. We have bedroom. Bedroom. Bathroom. Laundry room. Primary. We got the primary. So we got this massive shower. Dual sink vanity with nice light fixtures. Really nice colors. And then we got the closet. Walk in. Got the toilet there. Oh, hey, if you made it this far into the video, consider subscribing to the channel. On this channel, we post multiple times a week for real estate content throughout Central Florida, East Orlando, West Orlando, North, South, Winter Garden, Kissimmee, all over the place. Today, we're in Sunbridge, which is in St. Cloud, Florida, not too far from Lake Nona. Ashton Woods, Brigham model. At the time of this video, they actually got one of these bad boys for sale that's closing in April, May for 6.30. So we have dining here with the option of turning this into like a study or a den or a bedroom. We have a bedroom here they're using for the sales office. We got a full bathroom there. Another bedroom here that they could convert into an open dining room if you were to close off the space over there behind me. Then we have beautiful kitchen. Massive island. Amazing light fixtures. I see, I like the blue. You got the blue on top of the light color and then you got the brown on the floor. This is nice. But what's really special is what's behind those doors over there. Can't wait to show you that. We got a half bath over here. We got a primary right through here. This is awesome. And you got like the, the tray ceilings up there. Nice ceiling fan. Toilet tucked away over here. Really a uh, long shower. Nice size walk-in closet. Whoa, this is nice. Show you something magical. 
This is cool. Watch this. You got the patio back here. Then you have a two car garage or two and a half car garage. You put a golf cart in there as well. They also build these with three car garages. So the garage is that way. But there's stairs here that will take you to the top of the garage. And at the top of the garage, let me catch my breath. Oh, my breath is taken away again. You have a one bedroom in-law suite. You have a, a income generating property on top of your garage. This is amazing. Right behind me is the water, no sorry, the air handler in that little door behind me. But you got the essentials here. You got a couch, you know, enough space for the living room. You got a, this is a nice size kitchen for an in-law suite, it's full kitchen. And then you got a full bathroom. You got a full closet, full bedroom. And what's awesome is the laundry goes here. It'll be a stackable laundry. This thing here can rent for 15 to 1700 the time of this video for this one bedroom. So I can help offset the mortgage. And it costs about $120,000 to add this upgrade. So 120 K. Right now where we're located, we're in St. Cloud. So we're a little North St. Cloud and we're South Orlando. We're like on the east side. So Vito's North, Sanford's North, St. Cloud is a little bit South and Lake Nona is a little bit North. We're about 10 to 15 minutes from the airport, uh, 20 minutes depending on traffic. And to get to the parks, we're about less than an hour away to all the attractions in Orlando and downtown Orlando. So we're very centrally located. A lot of convenient things nearby. We got David Weekly in Sunbridge as well. This is the Voyage model. Let's check it out. Awesome elevation. You know, the siding, the red, the white. You got the brick right here in the front. This patio porch. It's amazing. So when we walk in, we have your little home office Clo like it's not closed off but if you close it off this could be like a nice little guest room or something for like a little walk-in closet not a walk-in closet but like a one of those ikea closets and then we have this open floor plan with the kitchen dining and living i'm digging those accent walls that they put there those panels Take a look at this kitchen. Nice. Behind door number one, we got storage. Let's take a look upstairs. Okay, have an awesome loft right over here, right next to the laundry room. Oh, this is killer. You have the laundry room, and then you have like a space right there to fold the clothes. There's a duck. You got a duck over here. Got a quack. Whoa. This deserves a more cinematic entrance with the video. This is nice. You got the high ceilings, panels on the wall, with the accent. Then we have this massive walk-in closet. I'm digging that blue teal. Huge shower. And you have that overhead shower as well. I'm liking these borders around the mirror. Pretty nice. It's not like a plain mirror like some of the other ones. And then you have more closet space over here. You guys know me, you know, there's always like a his and hers. So this is obviously hers for me. And then obviously this will also be hers. And then I will probably get this much space. Story of my life. All right, David Weekly Homes. Let's keep looking. We're back at the loft.
Okay, okay. Nice size bedroom. Then we have a little workout room over here. Somebody working out. He does not come with the house. And then we have the bathroom. Backyard, fenced in, kind of can hang out back here, those warm nights, and we have a massive beetle. Oh, you see that beetle, Noah? Nope, leave it alone. All right. Craft Homes, Clover model. I got the bat, you got the brick. You know, I like the brick. And I got the brick here, and I got the patio. Okay, okay, ceiling's very high. Right to my left, we have a little office space, flex space. They put some accent walls here. And what's interesting is they have the double doors, so you have some privacy there, it's awesome. half bath right there when you walk into the property hang up the purses there the keys for the dog leash you have a two-car garage with the tesla power wall i think a lot of these homes here have tesla's uh roof tesla solar roof which is awesome as well this one already has the tesla charger boom just plug your tesla in right there You got a map. All right, we got the kitchen. Massive island, crown molding on the cabinets. You got the vent for the stove, which is the glass top. Pretty luxurious if you ask me. I'm digging this brown on white. Pretty nice combination. Farmhouse sink. This is a massive sink. Imagine washing dishes in there. Well, I can't because I use a dishwasher. So over here we have the pantry with a closet and a hiding spot. And a hiding spot. Some Christmas decorations there, some Halloween decorations there. Living room. Dining. This is this is nice. Primary. Loving the little light blue color. Bathroom two with two sinks side by side. Two fish. We got the shower that kind of like steps down. Huge primary closet. You know me, I'll rip it up and put some custom stuff in there. Stairs yet. This is quite a house. We have the laundry room. Whoa, with the is it a closet? We have a closet in the laundry room. Some cabinets, space to fold clothes, and, and a sink, as well as more cabinets and more clip things. That's quite a laundry room. This might be a winner. This house. All it needs is a nice loft. And I think it'll be a winner. Oh, hey, what do you know? You have a nice loft over here. So you have the furniture with the TV mounted right there. And you have your bike. If you want to go take a ride outside. We got a bedroom. Basketball themed bedroom. Well, I don't think the statue. I don't think the statue is free. So then over here. Next bedroom. Next bedroom. 
last bathroom, full bath with a tub. Tic-tac-toe. 